What's up everybody? We're back with another E93 video. I've been edging to work on this car. And the thing I'll be doing today is pretty cool. Today we have a cheap but effective mod when it comes to aesthetically. We're gonna pop the hood here. And take a little screwdriver kit bit here. On the E90 chassis, the grill comes in a singular but uniform kind of shape. Today, we're gonna be replacing it with something new. If you guys haven't seen these before, these are the F style grills off of the F chassis BMWs. These grills are a little different. They're double slotted and these are gloss black. While these were originally chrome, but I actually plastic dipped them matte black. Although they look terrible now, in the beginning when I did plastic dip them, I like them a lot better than the chrome that was behind. As you can see, it was chrome before, that's why the top here is chrome and the front side here was just matte black just because I actually didn't open up the hood when I did it. But now, we're gonna be fully replacing these and hopefully, this will look better. First things first, get your little kit here. I got this from Walmart for like 15 bucks and thank God I have this little kit here because otherwise I would not have this at all. It looks like there's just one, two, three, and four T30 plugs. Oh, it's in. Okay, this is easier to handle. I'm putting I'm putting this down. These are like barely held on. <laughs> oh. Alright, after all the all loose, you honestly can just use the bit here and unscrew it like this. It's a lot easier because you only have space because of this. Alright, after they're all off, put them somewhere, don't lose them because that kind of touches the whole entire grill here to your bumper. Alright guys, so once they're all off, each one actually has six clips here. There's three at the top and three at the bottom you see over there. And it's off. <clears throat> I have no intention of fixing this and putting it back to chrome. Um, I'm pretty lazy, so we'll see what I do with these. What do you guys think though? The difference? You like these more? Let me know down in the comments. Either way, we bought these, so we're gonna put them on right now and see how it looks. The process of putting it in is gonna be the same as putting it out. The clips are all in the same place. One on the side over here, two at the bottom, and three in the top. So, just stick it back in. What do you guys think? Oh man. Wait, I think that looks real good. Yo. We put the hood down and see what you guys think. Hmm. I don't know which one I like more, just because they both have a different style, but let me know what you guys think. If not, I can always get these ones in the future, gloss black as well. All right, this is why you guys to be careful. These tabs are like pretty flimsy, especially from, from the E chassis and how old it is. Like, they're already pretty bendy, and this plastic is not great quality, so. Be careful when you do this. And just like that, we're all done. Personally, I think it looks pretty good. Gives it more of a modern touch compared to the old singular grills. Very well worth it. Now, all we need to do is put back the T30 screws back in the holes, align it up, and close the hood. Tighten up the last screw here, then you're done. Put this down, let's close the hood and see how it looks. Yo! Hey, that's pretty good. Oh, that looks so sick. I know it's a little hard to tell on camera just cause the black is pretty dark, but here's a little close up for you guys. But in my opinion, this looks awesome. Look at that. Yo, that is amazing. Like I said guys, just get this easily for like 20, 25, 30 bucks, even if it's not on AliExpress, on eBay, on Amazon. This is a sick replacement. It definitely shows a little more inside of the car as well. And if you just have this in the future, if you just have that little mod that's a V bar brace, that'd be pretty cool to show off as well. Overall, this is sick, guys. Oh my god. It changes the look of the car for sure. And this is also a super affordable and inexpensive mod as well. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Anyways, guys, that will conclude this video for the E93. It was super cool to put on this new grill and to see how it kind of looks. There will be plenty of mods coming soon and plenty of other things I'm gonna put on the car, so make sure to stay tuned. If you guys haven't already, Hit the subscribe and turn on post notifications. Thanks again guys and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.